Hello guys, what's up? Well, I'm back to kit and today this video my making has been suggested by you guys. I post a poll on my Instagram to appear. I don't know something about here ish. Asking what you want to make, I gave you a choice between chocolate ultimate cupcakes or chocolate truffles. Use all crows ultimate cupcakes. So that's what we're doing today. Roll, we'll roll the intro and then we'll get straight into making these fabulous cupcakes. <laughs> Right, so guys, the first thing you want to do, so this is step number one, is cream your butter and uh, should, should say margarine and your sugar together. By the way, you might need cereal sugar, like if, if yours is like mine. So once you've done that, you're going to go over to your stand mixer. Or you can use a hand mixer, but this is much easier. I'm going to set off and I'll come back when that is all creamed. Now that's all creamed, we are now going to get a bowl and we are going to whisk up three eggs. Oh crap. Three eggs in here. And then we're going to add them into the mixture gradually. So I'm going to come back once these eggs are all beaten and light and fluffy. Next, we're going to add in our cocoa powder. So let's just go sift that in. Let's so take this off the stand mixer. Your mixture, by the way, after you've creamed all the egg in, should look a wee bit like this. So, sift that. Next, we're going to just basically mix that all up now, and then I'll come back when that's all incorporated. Next, you want to seven half of your flour. So, remove it from the stand mixer. A sieve. So, it's about half. Don't need to be too accurate. Then we're just going to whisk that up. And once that's mostly incorporated, we're going to again take it off. And then add in our Baking powder, that's one teaspoon. Then you need to sieve it because it might be lumpy. Then just whisk that up until it gets nice and smooth and incorporated. And we'll come back when that's all smooth. Now that that's all nice and perfect, we're going to add in our three tablespoons of mint. That's, up. That's all my stuff. So next, we're going to get another half of our flour and sift it in. Now we're just going to sift that in. Go pre everything. We're going to incorporate that now, and then after that, we're going to add in our rock tips. So we'll come back when that's all incorporated. Next, we're going to get your chocolate chips, and we're going to incorporate them. Right, so next we're going to spoon them in the cases. First of all, they get everything else cleaned up, so we'll come back when it's time to spoon them in. 
been in case you scoop. So, we're going to use an ice cream scoop to scoop everything into these cases. By the way, as clean, it's just the way it's fight. So, about one ice cream scoop. We'll do one case. So, yep. Yeah. I'll come back once these are all in the cases because this is going to take me forever. Now, these are going to go into the oven for about 50, 12 to 15 minutes. So, we're now going to ice our cake. So, I've just quickly made up some buttercream. The recipe for which is linked in the description below. All it is is equal quantities of milk, butter, uh, or margarine, or an icing sugar. So, I'm loaded into a pipe bag and I'm just going to start to pipe them. Now we're just going to paint them rosettes on the top, so a bit like that. And there we go. That's the sort of thing. So you just basically swirl it around, then up like that. That's the technique, okay? So, I'm now going to fast forward till when these are all like complete. So, yeah, see that? Thanks for watching this video. As always, like recipe for these lovely things will be linked down below via my website. And also linked down below is my social media, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Which, if you don't follow me already, you probably should because I post polls in there, if, not every single day, but as often as I can to tell, to give you a say on what, this next, on what the next video might be. So, go over there and you might find a wee poll or two. So anyway, please like and of course subscribe for more videos like this one as well as many other types of food and cooking content.